Good morning everybody, welcome here, welcome back to my vlog. I think for this video I'm going to take you guys along with me for a full week of working as a full-time assistant for a restaurant owner here in Salt Lake City, Utah. I'm so excited about it. You guys seem to love these videos the most, so I figured I would take you guys along. It is Monday morning. I got up early. Well, I got up, I wanted to get up at 5.45, didn't happen. I got up at six, which is still pretty early for me in terms of like going to work out. Normally I work out in the evenings, but I've kind of figured out, even though I like it, I've been losing a little bit of like energy and like as it's starting to get closer into the year and like once it gets like summertime, I don't like to have my nights at the gym like I like to just get everything done in the morning so I can like have my nights you know so I figured I might as well put that into practice for the beginning of the year so I went to the gym this morning with my husband Sebastian it was very nice I did some upper body I did some abs feeling good then I came home quickly showered I didn't really do anything to my hair I straightened it or like um I have like the Revlon air dryer. I did that yesterday and then kind of just let it be what it is today. Got dressed, did my makeup, had my coffee and water and all of that and I'm just about to get started with work. So I thought I would start the vlog. Welcome here. Monday mornings are usually, well Mondays in general are just my busiest day. It just without a doubt starts out <laughs> so busy during the week and then by like Wednesday and Thursday I feel like I've like completed a lot of stuff. I have a good like hold on my week. Um, but Mondays are just like, we're back into it, there's lots going on, so that's what it is. So I first have to kind of like, I just like checking my emails, um, checking like the schedule for my boss, seeing kind of what's going on there. I have already done that, usually I do that like the day before, <laughs> like when I'm going to bed I'm like, okay, what do I have going on? Um, or rather like what does he have going on? And then um, in the morning it's just like, emails from the weekend or stuff like that. So that's what I'm gonna do for the next little bit. And then I usually like write in my planner, take a little bit of time for that. Then it is tax season people, well it's about to be. So we got like all of the W-2s for all of our restaurants. So I need to go through them, mail those out for the people that aren't current employees. And then for the people that are still working with us, I'm just gonna go drop them off at each location. So yeah. That's gonna take majority of my morning and then I usually like look at all of the um, bank accounts, make sure everything's good there, um, know any like recurring payments, stuff like that. I usually do that in the morning as well. And then I have like a meeting around like 3.30 or four and then <laughs> we'll see. Then it's just like random tasks. I do like the social media still right now and then um, just everything's like on my phone <laughs> for the most part. So that's gonna be our Monday. I'm really looking forward to it. I think Night, I definitely need to this is so like okay that should be better this is like not straight and it's bugging me okay that should be better um I definitely need to take down our Christmas tree in our bedroom because it is driving me insane that it's still up we don't even light it anymore like we don't turn on the lights or anything it's just there so I need to definitely do that um, which is good because I got my workout done in the morning which means I can do stuff around the house tonight so should be a good day I'm feeling now I'm feeling like tired now that I'm back from the gym everything's kind of like quiet down but I'm gonna turn on a podcast Mondays are the best because armchair expert has a new episode and I love that podcast it's like one of my favorite ones so I'm gonna listen to this get onto my emails and then we'll get the day started like off the charts like they belong together they're a good pair yeah <laughs> I like myself right now. I I, I think it'll go for a minute. Who was I just made a TikTok on this, but at all times I pretty much always have two to three drinks on my desk. <laughs> it's so funny. I just work through it all day long pretty much. I've got my YouTube station on. I'm doing the W-2s, putting them in envelopes, getting them ready to be dropped off and sent. I will say I literally cannot do anything with this band-aid on my thumb. I sliced, not really, but I did cut my thumb last night on a knife when I was washing it. So <laughs> I'm just realizing how annoying it is not to have full range of my thumb to do this. But anyway, that's my desk setup. This is what we're doing for the next probably like 40 minutes because I have a lot to put through um, in these envelopes. I think what I'm gonna do is do the ones that need to be dropped off today and then I can work on the ones that need to be mailed through the rest of the week. Okay, 
Okay, it is now the end of the day, which feels so nice. Got everything done. I'm in such a good place this week. I feel nice. <laughs> I feel nice for a Monday, but now I need to film a video for YouTube. So I do normally, like when it's vlogs, it's easy. Like this one will be done by next week sort of thing. Um, but since I didn't vlog over the weekend, I now need to spend my Monday night filming and editing so that I reach my goal of posting two times a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays on my channel. Um, so that's what I got to do. It's a good thing I worked out this morning because that means that I can just focus on YouTube. And this is just kind of the juggle of, I don't know, having like a full-time job, but also having something that you're like super passionate about and still want to give your all to. So we clocked out of one thing moving on to another. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. And it's nice. Like I still have a little bit of, I mean, you can see the sun on me, but it's definitely going down. So I'm going to have to speed this up before I lose all of the sunlight for the video, but it should be a fun one. I'm really excited. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. It'll be up before this anyway. So let's get to work. I feel like the vlog hasn't seen you in a while. Do you want to say hi? You still live here? Dude, it's been so long. Doing this vlog for real. I have long hair, probably. <gasps> oh my god, yeah. I did tell them that I made you cut it, so it's okay. Yeah, it's your fault. But it's better now. <laughs> yeah. The day has come to an end. As you can see, the sun is setting. I did film a video, which didn't take me long at all, which is so nice. I am just trying to stay on top of YouTube and everything. So right after work, I hopped right into YouTube, but I filmed that. I feel really good about it. I haven't edited it. That's such a hard word. I haven't edited it yet. <laughs> Oh my god. Um, so I don't really know. It's always one of those things where I don't really know if I'm going to like it or not. But either way, it's done. Now I'm going to also continue on with this like productivity that I have and like that I'm feeling. And I'm going to take down our Christmas tree in our bedroom. So to be fair, the Christmas tree downstairs was taken down, I think at like 1030 Christmas night. Like I was, I was done with it. I was I was over it. Um, but this one has kind of lingered. So I'm going to do that super quick. It's probably going to take me 10 minutes. Um, but yes, I feel good about it. I'm going to pop on my audiobook. I'm currently listening to Daisy Jones and the Six. And so far I like it. I like the audiobook because it kind of sounds like you're listening to like a like a Netflix documentary or something. There's just so many different like characters and voices that make it really interesting to listen to. So that's what I've been listening to and I really do enjoy it. I do think it's fun that every year we get like a silly ornament to put on our tree. This one, I don't, it's not really silly, but I think I picked it out our first Christmas together. It's a champagne bottle. The light is like terrible, so it's not focusing. And then we have a burrito, which of course Sebastian picked out. It's a fun one. And then for this year, I chose this bowl of ramen because I don't know, during like 2021 and 2020 when we were living when we were working together, we really loved a good bowl of ramen. I don't know, I thought it was cute and silly. So anyway, those are always my favorite to look back on. Much better, but this plant is outrageous. <laughs> so kind of takes up a big chunk of the corner, but it's kind of nice because we have nothing there anyway. So for now it lives there. Hello everybody. It is the end of the day on Tuesday. Is it Tuesday? It is. Um, I didn't vlog anything during my work day because it was pretty busy. We have payroll coming up um, this week. So it kind of just like, I don't know, takes a little bit more like effort and concentration on my day. Not that I'm not like concentrated and putting an effort, <laughs> but you know what I mean? It was just like one of those days where I was very busy. I had a meeting during the afternoon that I went out for, which was nice, and then I've just been back here finishing up, but it's the end of the day, and it's also Tuesday, and I'm repeating myself, but um, I am uploading my YouTube video, so I thought that I, um, I thought that I would just start up the vlog uh, for tonight, bring you guys a little bit into my evening on this Tuesday. Um, I'm uploading my vlog 
I feel like I've said this 15 times, but yes, I'm uploading my vlog. I thought I would talk about maybe the process of it. If you can hear my computer sounding like it's gonna blow up, that usually is how it all starts. Um, for some reason, my computer just cannot take it when I have when I have to upload. Like for some reason, it's just like so loud. Um, but what I usually like to do is edit it, get through the whole thing, and then honestly. I find editing to be pretty quick. I'm not somebody that does like extensive editing on my vlogs and stuff. I know that it could get very time consuming if you want it to, but for me, not really. So I find it to be really easy. The, hard, the part that's like so hard is like waiting for it to upload and then the freaking thumbnails. I hate doing thumbnails for some reason. I find them just like very, I don't know how to like grip you in as much or like, I don't know. I just find them a little bit more stressful. So that's what I'm working on right now. I've already uploaded it. Um, I've already put in like all of the mentions and all of like the tags and stuff like that that we have to do. And then um, now I'm working on the thumbnail. So, thought I would give you a peek into that. I'm probably going to be doing this until around like 6 o'clock, so like 30 more minutes. Um, it's 5.30 now. So yeah, I just find this process the hardest, I guess. But yeah, overall today's been great. I can't even believe it's Tuesday. I'm so excited because me and Sebastian, we've been wanting to do like a weekend getaway for, I don't know, just ever like after Christmas and like the busyness of all of it, we were just like, ah, oh, we just want to kind of get away for a quick little something. So we are going to go to Vegas this weekend. We leave on Friday. We're going to come back on Sunday. So a quick turnaround, but I'm so excited. I've already been on like TikTok to find all of like the fun places to eat. And we have our, like we have a couple spots that we already like want to hit, but it's nice to find new ones. Um, and who knows? I mean, we, it's not like it's going to be super hot, so we're not going to go like swimming, but hopefully like our hotel has like a fun hot tub or something like that. It'll just be so nice to get away. I don't know why I was so excited. So hopefully just the rest of the week flies by, even though I don't love when that happens, but I really want to get on my trip because one of my goals this year was to be better about printing out my photos. I have photo albums downstairs in our living room, but I don't fill them up ever. I used to be good about it, but now I don't do it anymore. So I decided to buy a couple of these disposable cameras. I love stuff like this. So I am going to take photos this weekend and also I wanted it for just the rest of the year whenever we do something really fun or memorable or sweet um, and then this is a good way to practice printing out your photos because I'll never be able to see these unless I actually print them out so that's why I'm so excited I just cannot even wait to I don't know like play around with this and see the photos so like I said I bought a couple from Amazon I guess they're kind of expensive for disposable cameras, but at the same time, they're just a fun, unique way to capture a moment. So I think it's worth it. Um, but I can leave the ones that I purchased down below. I haven't figured out where I'm going to get them developed or anything like that. So we will cross that bridge when I get to it, but I'm just so excited. So we're going to do that. I will take you guys along for the vlog as well. Um, but yeah, so that's on Friday and then tomorrow is Wednesday. We're not doing date night this week because we're going out of town. And so yeah, it'll just be like a nice week of just like getting work um, in a good spot to be able to leave for the weekend. So I'm feeling good about it. And now my computer has cooled down now. So I'm going to finish up this YouTube video, get it scheduled, ready to go by seven. And then we'll probably make some dinner and chill out for the rest of the day. I didn't work out today, but my goal is four times a week. So Tuesdays are busy for me and I didn't prioritize it this morning. So I might not make it happen. Um, but We'll see. Okay, <laughs> the time has come to finally eat dinner. I think we're pushing eight o'clock, which is very late for Sebastian and I, but I did some laundry and cleaned my kitchen, uploaded my video, so I'm feeling good. What time is it? It's really bothering me. <gasps> it's 7.52. So yes, um, there's never a good spot to put you guys in my kitchen because the lighting is always terrible. But 
it is 7.52, so we're gonna eat. We're doing the most random dinner because I just wanna get rid of like all our produce. So we have like potatoes that I roasted up. We only had ground beef defrosted. So we're doing kind of like a taco salad with potatoes. So we have like um, bell peppers, tomatoes, red onions, and then we have lettuce and then the meat <laughs> and potatoes. I don't know why, but I was like, I just have to make these. So should be good nice and filling and then i was gonna try and work out but that's not happening so we are going to go to bed early and then work out in the morning which i did yesterday and i really enjoyed it so i've been doing this app i guess not doing the app but i've been doing the workouts on the app so the app is called playbook and it's so nice i can't remember if you have to purchase you probably do um but there are just like a ton oof hold on there are just a ton of so Sebastian it's by Nick Bear Sebastian loves him but there's just a ton of like fitness influencers not even fit I say influencers like loosely um, but also like fitness trainers like real um, trainers real fitness people all of that and fitness people and there's like dance there's yoga there's recipes um, there's all different kinds of workouts but the one that i have been loving is by this girl called dr robin b and i've just been doing her program so i really like it um and it just helps like for someone like myself who i'm just so lost in the gym i just feel like ugh, i hate walking around and being like looking for a machine it's just probably like a, a death sentence to me is having to do that but i'm trying to get over that fear because it's like why does it matter <laughs> like everybody is just kind of in their own world and they're not really paying attention to me um but for some reason when i go to the gym i'm like oh my god everybody is staring at me everyone knows i don't know what i'm doing um but they most likely don't so i've been going with sebastian which does help because it's nice to like even though we don't do the same workouts it's just nice to know that like somebody is here that I know and that knows me you know what I mean so he's just like my comfort blanket but when he's not there which is often too because I need to go like when it's convenient for me um I have those workouts and I just love seeing videos and she just makes it really helpful and I've been feeling so sore from them so Okay, I'm heading up for the night, but I do have to let you guys know that these are seriously so amazing. One of my favorite treats for the evening. So I'm gonna take one of these, head up for the night, and I will check in tomorrow. How was your taco bowl? Oh, it was good. It's Wednesday. A brand new day and before I change out of my outfit I thought I would show it because it's kind of cute today can you see thankfully you can't see all the books that are still on my floor from Tuesday's um, video if you didn't catch that but um, yeah I just got home for the day actually so I'm finishing up the rest um, of my day here at home which is nice um it's uh, almost three o'clock so yeah i've just been hanging out it's been running around all day which is feel which feels nice um and then yeah now i'm home and i just ate a snack and so i'm like i need to get out of these jeans but i do really like the top i can see i've already stained it which is so fun and exciting um but this is from shein it's a cute little sweater vest um, that I've been wanting to get for a really long time, but I just, I really wanted to thrift one, but then I never go to thrift store, so I was like, whatever. Um, and then I just have my hair, it's kind of funky in this hat. And yeah, it's been a good Wednesday so far. The sweats are on, the hair is up, the day is done. We are winding down for the day. I thought I would take just oh my gosh I sliced my finger so bad that doesn't look so bad but I definitely did and I thought it was better and I didn't have to wear a band-aid but it is catching on everything today so I didn't realize like how much we use our thumbs but 
I can't even use it at all today, but that I would take a little bit of time just to do some laundry. I'm trying to keep up on our laundry. Um, I was talking with my sister-in-law about this because she was saying how she hates doing laundry. She has two kids and it's just not never ending. And I got so scared because I was like, I feel like our house would just be in Sebastian. Our laundry is never ending. And my mom has always told me that I, like I have a bad habit. I will wear the sweatshirt today and then I'll put it in the dirty hamper. Even though it's not dirty. I wore it for like, I don't know, six hours or something just at home. Um, and so I know that that's probably half the problem, but at the same time, like we go to the gym, we, I don't know. I guess I just feel like we always have laundry. And so it's just so funny. I'm trying to be better about not putting everything in the dirty hamper if I've worn it once. But for some reason, I just get so weird about clothes. And I just, if I've, especially if they're work clothes, like that's different. Like if I've been working all day and then I come home, like I have to put those clothes in the dirty hamper. Like I just, ugh, it bugs me. So anyway, that's my spiel. I'm going to sit here. I'm almost actually... Already almost done with laundry, which feels nice. So I'm gonna do this and then kind of just try to keep up on the house. I have to do the dishes as well. So it'll kind of be a tidy with me sort of night tonight, um, which will be nice because my house is a mess and I wanna keep it clean, so. Oh. <gasps> 